वेलकम फ्रेंड्स वेलकम यू ऑल इन माय चैनल केमिस्ट्री एंड हिस्ट्री ऑफ मॉलिक्यूल आई एम तोरमोय सो टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अ क्वेश्चन व्हिच केम इन गेट 2008 इट्स अ हाइड्रोबोलिशन रिलेटेड क्वेश्चन सो वी विल डिस्कस इट जनरली इट इज ट्रू दैट राइट नाउ सच टाइप ऑफ इजी क्वेश्चन विल नॉट कम इट इज ट्रू बट द लर्निंग और द मैसेज ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम सच टाइप ऑफ रिएक्शन will be useful to solve a question because generally they put multiple reaction at a particular at a particular question so it such type of reaction could be a part of that multiple steps okay so let's start initially i'll explain everything in details and at the end i will explain you about the tricks how to solve this question within a minute so i request you please uh, pause the video at this moment and you try by yourself after that i'll explain Okay, I expected that you have paused the video and tried. So let's start the explanation. So okay. So you can uh, see this is a hydroboration oxidation. This is a hydroboration oxidation. Hydroboration and oxidation. I have made several video about uh, oxid hydroboration oxidation. So I request you. to see those video then you will have a clear idea about hydroboration oxidation in this this reaction is a very important reaction along with this 9 bbn si alpha 2 bh etc i have made all this video about this okay so let's start so what happens when this uh, molecule this uh, methyl cyclohexene attached to bh3 so bh3 is obtained from b2 H six dimer. Okay, this is BH three, and we know that here the here the hydrogen will attach that uh, carbon which is poorer in hydrogen because this hydrogen is delta minus, and according to Markovnikov's rule, the negative part of the addendum will attach to that carbon which is poorer in hydrogen. okay so here so here the uh, hydride will attach here get attached here so if hydride get attached here then this this is this is uh, it's a hydride and this is methyl right now we are not sure that which three to isomer will be produced and this is b actually it is better to write br2 because this three hydride will attach to three alkyl uh, three uh, this boron will be attached to three alkyl group that's why i'm writing this br2 and just we will focus only one then you'll understand the rest now the important message is boron hydrogen addition happens through a four member transition state and this is a syn addition so point is four member ts and c addition c addition okay means same side addition so for example the side where hydrogen will be there that side will be on there it is true okay so what will happen after that what will happen it will undergo oxidation in presence of alkaline hydrogen peroxide actually what is the reagent that is hydrogen peroxide anion will be produced in presence of alkali and that will act, uh, that will attach first with this boron and secondly migration will happen from this to this so ultimately what will be produced ultimately it will produce this methyl this hydrogen and oxygen boron and for here i am also or same thing happen for this two also or now in presence of alkali this bond will hydrolyze because alkali will go and attack boron and in this way this will come out and produce alcohol means it will abstract proton from the solvent molecule and it produce alcohol so this is the overall mechanism 
for hydroboration. And in a brief, in details, you check my video. Now, from this mechanism, we can conclude that this will not happen, one point. And as we know that the boron prefers to attach on the less in that side, so this will not happen. And from here also, this will not happen. So the confusion is this and this. Now, as I told that hydrogen and boron should be cis or C. Okay. Then hydrogen at that side, boron will be that side, and this hydrogen and alcohol both will be seen because during the migration, no change in configuration. Okay. The overall group migrates without so with retention. So, so now hydroxyl and OH seen. So if hydroxyl and o, uh, H seen, then OH and this should be anti. Where this is, this is. So this is the answer. It must be anti. Okay. So this is the answer. Now I will tell you the tricks to solve this question within 30 seconds. How? For example, you can see that given this example, we know boron prefers to attach less in that side. Okay. And another thing, hydroboration oxidation in presence of hydrogen peroxide produces alcohol. Alcohol produces means initially this is off. Second, boron prefers to attach on the less hindered side. So this is more hindered side. So this is off. Now the main confusion arises between this and this. And we know that hydrogenation, hydroboration is a C addition. So C addition means and ultimately that where boron is attached, similarly oxygen will attach, means alcohol. So Alcohol hydrogen, so here if methyl is above, then hydrogen is below, and alcohol and hydrogen should be seen. So, this is the answer. So, within 30 seconds, you can solve this question. Okay, okay, fine. So, this is the end of video. I will give you some comment about this. Sometimes you may have confusion why hydrogen peroxide is there, it's an oxidizing agent, then why. This alcohol couldn't oxidize. Actually, hydrogen peroxide is not that much capable alone to oxidize this. It needs some metal catalyst. That's why this oxidation, hydroboration followed by oxidation is so selective in terms of hydro, hydrogen peroxide that it ends up in alcohol. It doesn't go, but instead of hydrogen peroxide, if other oxidizing agent is added, then the produced alcohol could be oxidized into so, please keep this information in mind. For example, permanganate, dichromate, such type of region can oxidize the alcohol further to the carbonic compound. So, this is the end of the video. If you like my teaching, please like my videos and subscribe my channel, Chemistry the Mystery of Molecule and press the bell icon to get the notification of every single video and please share this video among your friends that many people could get benefit from my effort. So let's see you in the next.